last week, Garen and Ellie bagged two-thirds of the way up on the cabin, and the family debarked, dragged, and installed a huge tree trunk in the kitchen. Stay tuned as we continue our progress on the additions to the main house and cabin. All right, we're gonna start pallet boarding the outside of the outhouse today. We're just gonna kind of slat it up so it has that log cabin look. We need to find something as cool as the inside color to put on the outside. I think it Perfect. needs to be uh, butched up a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I said. The pink is a bit much, so. Oh! <laughs> pallet boards on the outside. Elle's brilliant idea. Put on the shape that every outhouse door needs. Okay, it needs to be a little bigger than that, I think. I need to do some adjusting, but it's close. It's close. Crescent moonish enough. It's beautiful, man. There we go. I think that's a little better. All right, she's all done. This is the final form of the outhouse. We got our little floor in there, new toilet seat on. And then I guess we gotta put some like screen we'll probably put over the venting holes. Flies and mosquitoes out there. Yeah, there, there it is. Have you ever pooped anything fancy? To be honest with you, I don't think I have. I've been looking for guinea keats for a long time locally. They've been really hard to find. You can always order things online and have them sent to you, which I've done in the past, but there's a lot of deaths. I'm so excited. If you've ever had birds in the house, you'll know it gets old really super fast. I'm gonna do it anyway. And the gal told me to put pebbles in the water so that they don't put drown. The so we've got a little heat lamp here. We have it just in the corner, so if they want to go away from the heat lamp, they can. Or tonight when it gets colder, they'll probably be all bundled up in there together. So we'll see how long we can put up with them in the house. <laughs> and then, uh, then we'll bring them outside with the other ones. The reason that we like to have guineas is we have one male guinea. All the chickens tune into him and he alerts everybody if there's like a little guard dog. He really helps protect all the chickens. Been with us for 10 years, just always on the lookout. If he makes a noise, everybody reacts to him. He's been just a fantastic addition to our farm. He just roams the whole farm and can get away from anything. We lost our females in the past because they go out and they nest. A wild animal gets them out there. We keep them with the chickens so they can't fly out. It's for their own safety. They'll have to nest within the big chicken area. Pretty excited about these little guys. So I hope they do well here. All right, so this week my parents came up and helped us a ton. Down, we were able to get these really tall walls. There, we had some extra hands. Diesel hasn't been feeling too good. We had to take him to the vet. He's on the mend now. Yeah, uh, you're looking good though, aren't you? Where are you at, Petrol? Huh? Why are you ignoring me? Why are you ignoring me? All right, so here's our goal today. To take down the ceiling, get it loaded in the back of the truck, and get this back to a reasonable stake. So we got company coming tonight by two o'clock, because that is when the dump closes. Are you guys ready now? Yes, we're ready. Uh, is this an actual stretch? We don't know. Four hours, we can do it. Right. Don't take me down. <laughs> I keep it on. So it's not completely off. Do 
I've turned off the fan. Time to drop the fans then. Okay. This entire wall is all going to be gone. We're going to be pushing this out. Uh, we had already planned to take out the entire ceiling and it, make it more of a cathedral ceiling with it uh, open. This wall will stay on this side here. I'll most likely fill this in and then just make this a master bath on this side and then move this wall. Eventually we'll move over to here a little further and we'll create a pantry. And shivers down your spine. Whoa. After your parents left, some friends came down. Uh, and they helped us finish up the last few rows, which was just perfect timing on both their parts because yeah. it was just like right when we needed right extra when hands. We needed it. Thank you so much, guys. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> it was Life so helpful. It was a lot of fun to work with other people, too. We made it to the top of the window frame, so now I'm just putting together a couple headers here uh, on the two small rooms, the two shorter rooms in the back. These guys are going to go on. Do more of the tree. That is cool. Look what I found. A chicken egg? I think so. Well, that's disgusting. Oh, there's something in it. I thought the egg was fascinating. You could hear it oh, clinking okay. around. So I was like, I, okay, it's I really dry. should have asked you to sniff it. Do you know how rotten that could weird, smell? Huh? Oh my gosh, he just broke that open. I was a little surprised he cracked it. <laughs> I want to see inside of it though, I'm curious. You are daring, Bryson. It's oh. into its petrified age now. Wow. It was so fascinating to see it all in there, wasn't it? Uh -huh. I had to have been like... It like petrified it. That's crazy. Disgusting, That right? must have been back when we had like chickens that were around here. Many, 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 many years old. Many Past years rot. Old. Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna be so happy when this job is done, because besides the wall, this was actually a job we were dreading work because of all the sheetrock and insulation and all this stuff coming down. It's gonna be so nice to have this job done. Some of our main support beams we're trying to take down right now. Yeah. It's bigger than I thought it was gonna be. For some reason I thought, oh yeah, we'll just take it down and haul it out. And it wasn't quite as easy as all that. As a matter of fact, why don't we put both cabinets on this table? You have to be careful with the way you take it down because you don't want the whole thing falling in. So you're like, oh, wait a minute. I have to take this yeah, piece by piece off. I can't just rip it down like the wall. Here's the wall yeah. that the guys were kept cutting out this area, and that's where the, it went through over there. So as you can see, this is all going to come down. That's why we weren't too worried about it. much as we could get done, we gotta start packing up and heading off to the dump, so let's do it. We started to see the light at the end of the tunnel, you know what I mean? Like, you're like, wow, this really is gonna be bigger. So it's feeling a lot better now. The medicine really helped. Petrol's ready for him to play. We're done! Yeah.
Yeah, we don't care about it. A little bit left to go. The octopus guy from the Spider-Man universe. I was thinking it looks like one of those blow things. Oh yeah, the ones that wave in the wind. Those little squiggly eyes. <laughs> <laughs> Wanna know what happens when you take a support beam out? That was uneventful. I wouldn't want to hurt you back. That was so sad. If you're in your house and you hear this sound, run. Like some slush hammer to the whole deal. Okay, stand back. Wow. Is this the last piece, Bryson? The last melon. You guys got it down? Oh Looking yeah. Looking beautiful? Oh yeah. I'd say cleaning is definitely on the okay. agenda Bye, now. guys. <laughs> Bye. I All got right. plans for tonight. I don't know what you guys are doing, but. After taking the ceiling down, it's so big and beautiful. We're gonna have to rethink that pantry. And okay. What if we literally made that hallway the pantry and put a door in right there? That's a good idea. This Folks. could be the doorway to the pantry. But this door goes scooch over so that we can go through the closet of our room into the bathroom. We have yes. a real small bathroom, but that's okay. I planned a door there anyway. That oh, I love that. Here, that's it. Then this can all become the pantry then. Oh out. yeah, like all a all really big one? All the way to here, and then we use this corner of this for all your towels and stuff. Yeah. Okay, the first thing that comes to mind looking at the finished piece is you know in Aladdin when he's like a whole new world? Like that's what it's like walking into this place, isn't it? It is. It's really cool in there. It's like a whole yeah. new building. It, we feel like we're in a fancy place and it's not even done yet. Look at this house. This is incredible. It is incredible. It's like it's just jaw dropping. And it's pretty like, amazing. You look at the building, you're like, you don't picture that big of a ceiling and a beautiful entrance like that. Yeah. And you're not walking, you're like, wow. It's like walking into a cave. You know, you like walk into the cave and all of a sudden it just opens up. It's like, <laughs> You found a cavern and this you is know? it. <laughs> yeah, that, that's. Yeah, it's pretty amazing. But it's beautiful. Mm -hmm. Can't believe but it's our house. <laughs> I can't believe we only lived in the little part of it that we I did. Know, it's like, we're looking at it like... We restricted ourselves oh. so much. <laughs> we should have busted this wall out years ago. <laughs> One problem with the room. Oh yeah? Yeah. yeah. Uh, there's no windows. Dun, dun. So we're probably gonna need to get those little suckers in before the storm, more than likely. The storm because that's coming in I don't hour. think there's enough <laughs> buckets for that. Yeah, <laughs> for real. <laughs> yeah, I think they're actually done with the bagging up there. It looks like all the walls are up. They're so. going to need us to put up the roof. Dun, 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 dun. Stay tuned for that. Ellie refers to the, their new outhouse as a he. He needs to be uh, butched up a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> and Garen refers to it as a she. She's all done. This is the final form. So we're not really sure what gender it is in particular. Mm. <laughs> popular request we have put together a little cat team boo shirt that is going to be over on our spread shirt shop if you'd like to check that out the link will be down in the description we also just released if you missed it a whole bunch of team petrol team gizbo yes. team diesel bullet. team max team bullet you guys want to see a perfect specimen of an animal he's right here right here it's petrol right here not diesel. he's black with a blue collar <laughs> Ellie loves him the most. All of our little pets, we have them on t-shirts and all kinds of merchandise if you'd like to check that out. You have Link to collect be down all in the of description. them. Collect all <laughs> like, of them. Yes, uh, they'll be down there in the description if you're interested. This is going to wrap up this week. Thank you for being a part of our family. We'll see you next Friday. Bye. Bye. Too ambitious. You could do a walk-in pantry. Oh, it like opens up and you that. walk down. I was just gonna suggest I would that. love that. There's something hidden under here because we've been tapping on it. And it sounds pretty hollow in here. Just, Maybe it's that just listen to dollars this. Or that gun cash they said was buried on this property. Are you ready? <gasps> That's pretty solid. Does that not sound hollow? No, I feel pretty solid. I'm feeling it shake over here. Is Darn. That's normal. I think we should bust I it. I mean, up. I'm all for the, the conspiracy theories, but <laughs> over there. I'm gonna see if I can throw it and gently land it on the pile. Okay, I'm ready. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, overdid it. Our family moved from the city to the country. Thanks for taking part in our adventure. We have new videos every Friday evening.
If you would like to help us out, you can like this video, share it, subscribe, or support us on Patreon. See the links in the description. Oh, no, no hey, kisses. <laughs> no kisses. There <laughs> are. Little kissy kissy for the little kids. Oh. Oh, ah. what? Just decided to relieve itself on me. Hopefully its rear end was like <laughs> not hanging out. Let me, let me give you guys a hand. I'm I'm sucking up some of this stuff. We just start putting it up there. <laughs> Aboard. <laughs> <laughs>